By virtue of the powers entrusted to me, I institute this assembly into the 28th congregation of the Islamic University in Uganda. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. I have the honor to invite the rector of the Islamic University in Uganda, Dr. Ahmad Kawesa Sengen, to address the 28th congregation of the Islamic University in Uganda. Your Excellency, Professor Dr. Tan Kalman, University Council Chairman or Chancellor, Your Excellency, Ambassador Askar Usno, Assistant Secretary General of Sokol, Charge of Science and Technology, representing His Excellency, the Secretary General of OIC, Honorable Members of the Council, Honorable Members of the various University Council Committees, Staff of the Islamic University of Uganda, distinguished guests, graduates, the students of IYU, ladies and gentlemen, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. It's a great honor and privilege for me to, on behalf of the IYU community, and my own behalf, welcome you all, our distinguished guests, to this 28th graduation ceremony of the Islamic University in Uganda. We are humbled and very much appreciate your presence at this occasion, especially during this COVID-19 era. Uh, dear ladies and gentlemen, permit me to introduce to you our, our, our bosses who are joining us through technology. Uh, his Excellency Ambassador Skarimusino, the Assistant Secretary General for Science and Technology, who is representing His Excellency the US Secretary General, is joining us from Kazakhstan, where he is now. I also have the honor to introduce His Excellency Professor Dr. Tan Kalmarik, the University Council Chairman, who is joining us from Saudi Arabia. Ladies and gentlemen, we thank Allah for enabling everyone to reach this 28th graduation ceremony in spite of the COVID-19 pandemic. On this occasion, let me briefly inform you of the current status of the university. Student numbers. Currently, the university has a total student enrollment of 10,245. That is 5,355 males, or 52% and 4,890 females, or 48%. The students come from 21 countries, mostly in Africa. The students study at our four campuses, i.e. the main campus in Bali, Kampala campus at Chiguri, females campus at Kawaja, and Arua campus in Arua City. Academic programs. The university has a total of 87 faculty programs at its four campuses. The programs are offered in seven faculties, plus a center for postgraduate studies that handles the graduate programs. These programs range from certificates and graduate uh, to diplomas, bachelor's degree, master's, and doctorate degrees. The staff for IOM. The university uses the services of a total of 693 full-time members of staff and about 350 part-time members of staff. We thank the governments of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia and the Federal Republic of Nigeria and the Arab Republic of Egypt for supporting this. This year, a total of 70 full staff members are pursuing higher studies in various institutions worldwide. Of these, 33 are pursuing PhD programs, and we are grateful to all our development partners who are assisting the IUIU in this staff development program. I congratulate Dr. Moa Muhammad, 
the member of staff of YYU who completed his PhD student studies in food processing and preservation from University of Saint Malaysia in 2020 and returned to America. I also congratulate Dr. Lauren as only who recently accomplished her PhD in food science from the Kenya University. We thank all our staff for the great work they are doing for this university. In spite of some challenges, we still face. It is their commitment and hard work that has contributed immensely to making IUI what it is today, and for our being here to have this graduation ceremony. Please give them a big clap. The graduates at today's ceremony. A total of 872 graduates will receive awards in graduate school schools. They are broken down as follows. Certificates 54, undergraduate diplomas 102, bachelor's degree 674, postgraduate diplomas 8, master's degree 14. The male graduates are 421. Oh, 48 percent, while the females are 451, or 52 percent. This is the first time in the history of IUIU we are graduating more females than males. And I wish to congratulate all the females for making it to this day. You may also wish to note that this year IUIU will have more than one graduation ceremony. The next one is scheduled for the 27th March. 2021, at which we expect about 1,400 students to graduate. I wish to encourage the concerned students to start clearing for the March 2021 graduation as early as possible to make the process easier for themselves and the university. Second batch of medical doctors. Today we are graduating the second batch of medical doctors from IUI. A total of 57 doctors have completed their studies for the award of the Bachelor of Medicine and Bachelor of Surgery degree of IUI. We thank Allah and all those helped to make this happen. And these include the big family of Martha, University of Mahon, Kilimuzin Hospital, Doctors Worldwide of Turkey, Istanbul Medellite University of Turkey, Masaka Regional Referral Hospital, uh, Nagun Hospital in Tebe. Uh, hospital and all the other hospitals and health centers that have allowed our students to do clinical training there. We thank the staff of Habib Medical School and everybody who supported this program. Mr. Dean and your staff, we appreciate you for bringing us to this second batch. We thank the parents and guardians of our graduates for entrusting their children with IUI. We wish to assure them that we have not only given the graduates knowledge and skills, but we have also endeavored to inculcate in them the human values which we believe are critical for their success in life. At IUIU, we firmly believe that education without discipline can only produce empowered social leaders. We are therefore confident that if the graduates we are passing out today put in practice what we have taught them, they will be both excellent professionals and dependable human beings capable of possibly contributing to the social economic development of their respective countries. First class awards. A total of 55 first class honors degrees will be awarded to the graduates who have distinguished themselves academically and morally. Of these, 28 to 48 percent are males and 52 uh, percent are females. We congratulate them and wish them the very best in their endeavors. Dear graduates, I wish to remind you to always be grateful to those who have helped you on your journey to this day. I'm sure there are many people in your lives who have contributed and helped you in various ways on your journey to this day. Thank your creator and your parents most. You will live and work for the greater part of your life in this 21st century world. In the 21st century world, knowledge-driven society, you will be required to engage in lifelong learning. As one philosopher put it, 
the failures of the 21st century will be those who cannot learn, unlearn, and relearn. Another one said that when you have reached the top of the mountain, then you must begin climbing. You are therefore only at the beginning of your next phase of your pursuit of academic excellence. Go further and explore great academic horizons, research and innovations. Suffice it to add that the university has set up an intubation center in ICT for brilliant students to be able to further their research and innovative capabilities. It is called the Motion Analysis Research Laboratory and it is based at Kampala campus. So far, 11 innovations have been done by our staff and students working in the MAL lab. On 19 September 2020, the Ministry of Science, Technology and Innovations launched two of the products of this intubation center. That is the automatic hands-free dispensers that you might have seen around, hand sanitizer, which was made by the Department of Pharmacology of the IUI Habib Medical School. We thank Dr. Umar Yahya and the HOD of Pharmacology and their teams for this great achievement. The university will award medals to this team at the March 2021 graduation ceremony. And please don't forget. Future plans. As reported previously, the plan of the university is that we must consolidate on the success of our aid. We shall also systematically put more focus on establishing programs in science and technology. We already have programs in the ICT and computer science, food science and nutrition, basic sciences, and health sciences. Our next focus, inshallah, resources permitting, is going to be the establishment of the focal type of engineering and technology at the main campus in Bali. To this end, we wish to thank the government of Uganda and the Islamic Department of for their support towards the university's efforts in establishing the focal type of engineering and technology. We are finalizing plans to start an endowment for work for in Zambia land which the government of Uganda most kindly donated to IYU, and we are immensely grateful to his excellency, the president, uh, for that donation. Uh, IDB Islamic Knowledge Bank has approved funds to construct the first building of the endowment at the tune of $14.58 million. And we have to thank IDB. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, on a personal note, I, as Ahmad Awesa Senelo, this is my last graduation ceremony as the staff and director of IYU. I joined IYU in October 1987 as one of the pioneer staff seconded by the government of Uganda to help start IYU. At that time, in 1987, I was 29 years old, just completed my PhD, and teaching at Makere University. Now I'm 62 years. This means that I've lived, that I've spent more than half of my life, 30, 33 years, or 62 years lived, working and serving in the IUIU in various capacities. Suffice it to note that I joined IUIU, that was still an idea in 1987. I participated in actualizing the idea into a university that started on 10th February 1988 with 80 students and two degree programs. Played a key role in its growth and development from a humble beginning to a now renowned international university with 10,245 students from different countries. Over 30,000 graduates, we include ministers, members of parliament, CEOs, successful entrepreneurs, etc., etc., spread all over the world. Living in university with four campuses, 87 academic programs offered in seven faculties by the Center of Postgraduate Studies, and eight faculties of engineering in the offering. And endowment builds 
and endowment building called King Fred Plaza, located in the heart of Calcutta City. And that the law was simply established at the Zambia in Calcutta City. And many other achievements that the available time has not allowed me to enumerate. I'm therefore very much thankful to Allah for giving me the opportunity to serve humanity through Adwaya. I sincerely thank the Uganda government, especially since President Jerry Bobita Museven, for the support and assistance extended to me personally and to IPID. I thank the OIC General Secretariat, the various university branch social persons I've had the privilege to work under, i.e., the Red Doctors, that's one hit of weight. Professor Dr. Abraham Umar Masih from Saudi Arabia, Dr. Abraziz Asubai from Saudi Arabia, and the current chairman, Professor Dr. Talal al Marki of Saudi Arabia. I'm grateful to the staff, students, parents, government partners, and the people of Bali, Kampara, and Arua, and all stakeholders for their cooperation and support. May Allah reward each and every one of you most appropriately. As I leave IYU, I wish to most sincere apologize to anyone I might have hurt or annoyed during my stay at IYU. Please forgive me as fair as human that I never did anything intentionally to hurt anyone. Throughout my stay at IYU, whatever I did was guided by, was guided by my incessant desire and intention to protect and promote the world being of IYU. I therefore request that as history begins to guide my life, work, decisions, omissions, and commissions at IYU, I should be judged in that context. I undertake to continue promoting IYU wherever I may be. I wish the new administration, staff, and students of IYU better times ahead. Let us work together to take IYU to the next level and make it a truly world-class university. Yes, we can, if we work together, guided by shared vision and understanding of the centrality of IUIU in the future of the woman in this part of the world. Appointment of new rector and vice rector of academic affairs. As you may be aware, since I'm leaving, the university has going to be managed by another team. The University Council yesterday appointed Associate Professor Ismail Sima Jagenda as the new rector. May I present you in this audience? <laughs> Professor Jagenda has been serving as Vice Rector of Academic Affairs and uh, he's a man of great uh, academic history, having taught in Makere, IYU, and uh, some universities in the USA. Congratulations, Professor Ismail, and I wish you the very best. The Council also appointed Dr. Jamie Tusemala as Vice Director Academic Affairs. Dr. Jamie Tusemala is an alumnus. Dr. Jamie Tusemala is an alumnus of IUIU, where he did his first degree in education in economics and and his study is studies as teaching subjects. He did his master's in economic policy and planning at Macquarie University. Came back to IUI and told, and taught. Became dean of arts, focus of Islamic study, focus of arts and social sciences. He was also heading the Center for Postgraduate Studies in IUIU. Then he left and went to Zanzibar University, where he was dean and director of the Center for Postgraduate Studies. That was after I completed his PhD at IUIU, which was also combined with the University of Dhaka and with some training at the Islamic Government Bank. Congratulations, Dr. Dami. Uh, Professor Dr. Abu Kazima Mbata remains our Vice Director of Finance and Administration. He's also an alumnus of IUIU, where I did the bachelor's degree in education, uh, economics, 
economics and history, did his master's and PhD in Gajabada University in Indonesia, came back, talked at Nkumba, and then came to IOIU. I congratulate you and we thank you for what you are doing. So I wish the team at the rectorship the best as they never see the university to the times. I will always be available whenever needed. Official. On the side note, I have done present you to inform you that we will send a lot of some key members of the university community. They are the Red White Honorable Hajj Dr. Ali Moabe, Kiruna Akiwe Jinya, who served the university in many different capacities as the Vice Chairman of the University Council, Chairman of the Estates Planning and Government Committee, Chairman of Appointments Committee, and uh, he has been in IUI since 1989. He passed away recently. May Allah grant him gender freedoms. We might also have heard that we lost the late Dr. Anas Abdunur Kalisa, uh, who at one time was Vice Rector of Academic Affairs and another time Vice Rector of Finance and Administration, but was also a senior lecturer teaching at IUIU. May Allah forgive him and grant him gender. You may also have heard that we lost Dr. Mukandit Baronde, uh, who was uh, at the time of his death the chairman of the Ghana Muslim Supreme Council. He passed away on the 14th December 2020. Prior to his election as chairman of the Ghana Muslim Supreme Council, Dr. Baronde worked as lecturer and dean of the Faculty of Islamic Studies and Arabic Language at the Islamic University of Uganda. We pray to the right of God to bless to Bless this mercy unto them, to work them abundantly, and grant gender freedom to them, and all our shapes and friends, and relatives, and all Ugandans, and human beings all over the world who have succumbed to the COVID 19 pandemic. As you all are aware, the world is going through unprecedented hard times occasioned by the COVID 19 pandemic. In Uganda, Educational institutions are closed in March 2020 and remain closed except for the faculty students. The pandemic has affected the university, especially its cash flows. Our staff salaries were cut and other facilities suspended. As we speak now, we think the worst is over, and if universities are allowed to reopen fully by February 2021, IUI will be able to resume all its normal activities including paying some 100% of their salaries. With all of our and our community partners like the Islamic Solidarity Fund and the YSC that supported IYU during the darkest days of the COVID-19 lockdown. The university has also worked its own capacity to offer online teaching and learning. All continuing students are encouraged to use the IYU online platform to resume their studies and complete their academic programs. We are also continuing to admit students at all our campuses uh, in Bali, Kamboja, Chiguri, and Aurora. First year students of medicine have already started their studies, others will begin on 31st July 2021. So please, those who need admission, go to any of the IYU campuses or Kingford Plaza Upper Basement, where IYU has an office, or to the IYU website at www.iuiu.ac.ug for apply online. Appreciations on behalf of the staff and students of IUIU. I wish to extend my deepest appreciations to the government of Uganda for its continued support and assistance to IUIU. We are also thankful to the governments of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, the state of Kuwait, Egypt, Nigeria, and Turkey, for their extended uh, support <laughs> to IUIU. We thank His Excellency, Professor Dr. Malik Taran, the University Council Chairman, for his great contribution and leadership of IUIU. We thank all our council members and council committees for their support and guidance extended to us. We thank His Excellency, the Secretary General, and His Excellency, Ambassador Askan Musunov. He is with us on Zoom from uh, Kazakhstan. Uh, 
for all their continued support. We are most grateful, Your Excellency. We thank the Zambi Solidarity Fund for the continuous great support given to IURU. The Zambi Solidarity Fund is the uh, financial the single most uh, important financial that gives us more grants than anybody else. We thank the Zambi Government Bank uh, for a lot of assistance that has come to my own. We thank the University of Lahore in Pakistan, the Williams Hospital, the Abid family of Makkah, uh, Muslim World League, Ikra for Human Organization of Jidda, the International Islamic Charity Organization of Kuwait, Africa Muslim World League, Stop Direct Aid of Kuwait, Wame Kumbi of Saudi Arabia, Sisu of Turkey, Dr. Zawaka of Turkey, Kuta of Turkey, and all our great partners and friends for the enormous assistance extended to everyone. After Allah, we love to support, we will be able to achieve the lot. We thank the Minister of Foreign Affairs, our Line Ministry, for all the support they continuously give us. We also thank the Minister of Finance, Planning and Economic Development, and the Minister of Education and Sports, the Sector Ministry, and all other government departments for their valuable support and assistance. We thank all the staff, students, and other individuals who have contributed to the success of this occasion. Previous members, thank you for hosting us. Dr. Mary and your team, we are grateful for, for arranging. And all other staff from other campuses who have come to lend a, a hand to the females' campus. I salute the chairpersons and members of the various graduation subcommittees for your tireless and great efforts in making this occasion a success. We also thank the security personnel and members of the press, the police band, and everybody for your contribution to making this occasion a success. We are grateful to NBS Television, Salam TV, who are broadcasting this occasion live, and all the other media houses and platforms and social media that are airing this occasion live. We thank the ICT team for connecting us to the entire world. Lastly, we thank all of you distinguished guests for having accepted to be part of today's congregation. We pray to the Almighty Allah to reward you most appropriately, and please forgive me for my emotional speech, but 33 years is not an easy time. Uh, please remember, COVID-19 is real and is killing people. So I have a duty to remind you, especially those of you in the Muslim community, it seems to be hitting us more because of our practices of wudu, sharing wudu, uh, gadgets, uh, sharing the same mats. Please, let's be more careful. So please observe the SOPs, which include frequent hand washing with soap or sanitizer, Wear a mask in public, keep a physical distance of at least two meters, stay home and stay safe. May Allah protect all of us and forgive those who have already succumbed to the coronavirus pandemic. Because of this COVID, we are having this kind of scaled down graduation where most of our students or graduates couldn't be here because we had to obey the rules that limit gatherings to about 200 people. And that's why our parents who are listening to us, we apologize to you. It's not our making. would have loved to have you and share this occasion and this moment with you, as we always do. But these are hard times, and this is not an, a normal situation. And therefore, we couldn't have a normal graduation. We are having a scientific one. We believe and trust that wherever you are, you are with us, and you are, please know that we are with you, and we are celebrating with you this great occasion. So our graduates, those who have been able to come, the medical students and students of nursing and midwifery, they are the only ones we could accommodate in this space in order not to exceed the number of 200. So I congratulate everybody again and wish everybody the best of luck. Thank you very much. It's now my honor and privilege uh, to invite His Excellency, 
Ambassador Skari Musinov, Assistant Secretary General in charge of Science and Technology at the OIC Secretariat, to deliver his speech on behalf of His Excellency, the Secretary General of OIC. Your Excellency. Your Excellency, Dr. Tareli Maliki, Chancellor and Chairman of the University Council. Right Honorable Moses Ali, First Deputy Prime Minister and Head of Government Business in Parliament of the Republic of Uganda. Distinguished guests, dear parents, graduates, ladies and gentlemen, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Alhamdulillah, all praise to be to Allah the Almighty, by whose grace and blessing we are able to hold this 28th graduation ceremony of the Islamic University in Uganda. Allow me at the outset to convey to this August gathering warm greetings from His Excellency Dr. Yusuf al Taymin, Secretary General of the Organization of Islamic Cooperation, and his best wishes on this important occasion. This year's graduation ceremony is taking place amidst the COVID-19 pandemic which has claimed hundreds of thousands of lives. I would like to use this occasion to express my profound condolences and solidarity with the families and societies whose people have lost their lives to this disease, those who are battling for their survival and those whose lives and livelihoods have been affected by the pandemic. Uganda and the Ayu Ayu family in particular was one of his gallant warriors to the pandemic, the late Right Honorable Ali Kirunda Kvinja, former Second Deputy Prime Minister and Minister without portfolio and Vice Chairman of the Council. We wish to convey our sincere condolences to His Excellency the President of the Republic of Uganda, the government and the people of Uganda, and the bereaved family on this great loss. His contribution in furthering the cause of education and serving the Ummah and humanity at large will forever be remembered. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, Ayu Ayu, like all other institutions of learning the world over, has been gravely affected by the pandemic. According to the UN policy brief on education during COVID-19 and beyond, issued in August 2020, the pandemic has created the largest disruption of education system in history, affecting nearly 1.6 billion learners in more than 190 countries and all continents. Closures of schools and other learning spaces have impacted 94% of the world's student population, up to 99% in low and lower middle income countries. That is a global outlook back home Ayu Ayu, as you all know too well, has not been spared from these challenges. It is, however, a source of pride and happiness that the university is still operational and slowly but surely adapting to the new normal at this graduation ceremony demonstrates. This has been possible due to the support extending by all the stakeholders and to the dedication of university faculty and staff. Let me use this opportunity on behalf of the OIC's General Secretariat to extend our sincere thanks and appreciations to the Islamic Solidarity Fund for the financial grant it has extended to the IUIU. Our thanks also go to the government of the Republic of Uganda under the wise leadership of His Excellency President Yoweri Mussolini for the patronage and support IUIU has enjoyed and continues to enjoy. We value highly, highly the guidance, support and close cooperation that the University has been receiving over the years from different agencies of the host government. I also acknowledge the hard work and dedication of IUIU faculty and staff and members of the University Council for their remarkable support during these very difficult times. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, although the university has come this far and has produced thousands of graduates who have contributed to the social economic developments of their countries and communities, it is still facing enormous challenges that prevent it from realizing its full potential. 
In this era of rapid technological advancement and globalization, the university needs to be well positioned to continually adapt its curricula to equip its students with cutting-edge technology. There is no room for complacency in the present-day world. Rather, a conductive environment should be created with a culture where a culture of uh, unsatiable inquiry and research among, research among the students and staff thrives. To this end, OIC is fully committed to mobilizing all possible support for IUIU to fulfill its mandate and achieve its vision of becoming a center of academic excellence that produces skilled, ethnical believing individuals to positively transform the world. Dear graduates, I wish to congratulate you all on this successful completion of your studies at the university. I hope the skills that you have been taught and the knowledge that you have acquired will give you confidence to face the future unafraid because there is so much there is so much fear in the world right now and there is only one reliable antidote the knowledge and the wisdom that comes from knowledge in this changing technological milieu and consequent pressure of changing career cycle you must strive to keep yourself abreast of the new frontiers of technology in order to make progress in your life and now I address the parents and well-wishers of the IUIU. Let us all continue working together in improving our institution. Through your concerted efforts, the university has achieved a lot. With the renewed momentum inspired by our resolve to overcome the current challenges, I am confident that together we can help the university to achieve more. Thank you very much. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Before we go to the speech of His Excellency, the Chancellor, the Chairman of the University Council, we want to recognize uh, in our company, Dr. Abdurrahman Azaid, Assistant Secretary General of the Muslim World League, who is joining us from Mecca via Zoom. Thank you very much, Dr. Abdurrahman Azaid. We are also joined uh, His Excellency Ambassador Isaac Sebulime, Uganda's ambassador to the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia and the OIC. Thank you for joining in, Ambassador Sebulime. We are also joined by my other colleague at Kampala International University, Dr. Muhammad Ifeza Mihigo, the Vice Chancellor of Kampala International University, and the parent of the one of the daughters graduating in medicine today. We congratulate you and we thank everybody. It's now my honor and duty to invite His Excellency Professor Dr. Talal Al Malik, the chairman of the University Council or Chancellor. Uh, he's a, a pediatric surgeon by profession. So, and uh, he's from Saudi Arabia has worked and served in many universities. So he's a great academic in his own right. Uh, Professor Dr. Tala Aran Maliki, you have the floor. Thank you very much. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Alhamdulillah. Wa salatu wa salamu ala Rasulillah. Your Excellency, the Assistant Secretary General of the Organization of Islamic Cooperation, OIC members of the University Council and Council Committees, rectors and staff of IUIU, distinguished guests in your respective capacities, the graduates, the students of IUIU, ladies and gentlemen. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. All praise and thanks are due to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for enabling us to hold today this 28th graduation ceremony of Islamic University in Uganda. On behalf of the University Council, staff and students of IUIU, and my own behalf, 
I extend my warmest appreciation and welcome to all our guests for attending this auspicious occasion. Your participation in this ceremony is highly inspiring. to all of us, especially to the future leaders of this great country and Africa at large, the brilliant graduates. Today, today's graduation ceremony is special in the sense that it is a scientific one, mainly virtual, apart from a few medical and nursing midwifery graduates. The other graduates are following on television, online, and other social media. This is because of the unprecedented effects caused by the COVID-19 pandemic. I wish to congratulate the graduates, their parents, and loved ones. Today marks a great day in the academic career of each one of you. To get to this point, each one of you has had to work hard, persevere amidst many challenges, and remain focused. Great sacrifices in terms of money, patience and time had to be made for you to achieve your education dream. Congratulations. As you celebrate this achievement, I wish to remind you that this should not be the end of your academic career. You need to aim at achieving more academic qualifications. As the 21st century world you will live and work in is very, is very competitive. We know that equipped with the knowledge, skills, and values gained at IUIU, you will develop your respective countries and contribute to the well-being of humanity in general. We wish you the very best in your future endeavor. Ladies and gentlemen, on this occasion, I wish to take the opportunity to thank the government of Uganda for the great support that it has extended to IUIU since its establishment in 1988. We are also so grateful to the Organization of Islamic Cooperation, OIC, and the Islamic Solidarity Fund for their enormous support to the university since its formation. Our gratitude is further Our gratitude is further extended to the Islamic Development Bank for their continued great support, including the recent decision to finance an endowment of IUIU and a Faculty of Engineering and Technology at the main campus in Mbale. We also thank the government of Kingdom of Saudi Arabia for its continued support since 1974, when the idea of establishing IUIU was agreed upon by OIC heads of states and governments, the latest of which is the generous donation by to build a library at the main campus, which is already going on. We also thank the government of State of Kuwait, 
Federal Republic of Nigeria, the Arab Republic of Egypt, and Republic of Turkey for their various contributions to the university. We are highly indebted to ISISCO, the Muslim World League at, of Mecca, IICO of Kuwait, Africa Muslim Agency, Direct Aid, and all other organizations, institutions, and individuals for the support they give to IU, IU, and continue to do so. Director, Dr. Ahmed Sarando, Vice Director, Deans, Heads of Departments, and all the staff of IU, IU are thanked very much for their dedication and hard work. In a special way, I wish to thank all the staff of IU, IU, who have had to endure the financial hardships occasioned by COVID-19 pandemic. We hope that the situation will improve beginning of January 2021 and get back to normal by February 2021. I want to assure you that the University Council is aware of the challenges you still face and is doing all it can do to address them. We appeal for your prayers and continued patience and cooperation as we work together to overcome all the challenges. I wish to inform all our stakeholders that IU, IU still needs a lot of support to achieve all developmental goals. We count on you. We count on you to help the university grow further to better serve humanity. We thank all organizers of this occasion for the great efforts. We also thank members of the press for covering this event. Before I close, and in anticipation of a lot of mishaps with the Zoom and uh, some disruptions may happen, I delegate my authorities of following on the announcements until the end of this celebration to Rector Dr. Ahmed Sugando to call for that. Finally, I wish to thank all of our distinguished guests for accepting our invitation. May Allah bless you all. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to invite the deans of faculties to present to you candidates who have successfully completed their studies for the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of certificates undergraduate diplomas, bachelor degrees, postgraduate diplomas, and master's degrees of the Islamic University in Uganda, Dean Faculty of Management Studies. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the year 2019-2020 academic year for the award of certificate in public administration of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Abdul Wahab, Alule, Khalil, and Obiga. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the year 2019-2020 academic year for the award of certificate in business studies of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Adia Bako, Deogracious, Mohammed 
Serwa, Zumura, and Namboze. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Certificate of Library and Information Science of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Asirokan, Yataru, Onziri, Peace, Pepe, Serubide, Jidongo, Kakai, Kitutu, Maweje, Namataka, Nambozo, and Nandutu. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Certificate in Records Management of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Akandiru, Anroth, Anzoyo, Dasalam, Farida Saidi, Farida Samsa, Knight, Ochokoru, Wamamili, Yeka, Abbas, Halima, Hussein, Kanyago, Mes, Namatovu, Nambozo, Namhose, Nandutu, Nantalaga, and Watulo. May the graduates for the Certificate of Midwifery and Certificate in General Nursing please stand up to swear the professional oath. Oath for the nurses, I solemnly pledge myself before God and in the presence of this assembly to pass my life in purity and to practice my profession faithfully. I will abstain from whatever is deleterious and mischievous and I will not take or knowing you administer any harmful drugs. I will do all in my power to elevate the standard of my nursing profession. And I will hold in confidence all personal matters co committed to my keeping and all familiar affairs coming to my knowledge in the practice of my calling as a nurse. With loyalty, I will endeavor to aid the physician in his work and devote myself to the welfare of those committed to my care. So help me, Allah. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who, has, who have successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of certificate in midwifery of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Aplot, Chemsungun, and Zawede. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of certificate in general nursing of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Nambozo, Wamanga, Chemtai, Nawal, Tumujuke, and Waninda Yunus. Bismillah, by virtue of the powers entrusted to me, I congratulate all of you whose names have been read for certificate awards of the Islamic University in Uganda in your respective programs as presented by the deans. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in Early Childhood Education of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Akaire Farida and Nakiri Jha. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in Primary Education of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Kagoya, Muhumuza, Munib Ali, and Seba Kaki. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of concurrent diploma in education of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Isaac Abdul Kadir, Kibuka, Maganda, Maimunatu, Namugosa, and Were Abdul Karim. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidate who successfully completed 
her studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Arabic Diploma Program of the Islamic University in Uganda. She is Safi Obile Tuku. Dean Law. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in Law of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Amina, Kawugu, and Serubibi. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in Business Administration of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Lulu, Nawire, and Nalusiva. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in the Public Administration of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Achidiri, Banula, Gule, Mudua, and Wandawa. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of a diploma in business studies of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Achema, Akoi, Halima, Isakwa, Mary Nene, Namasava, Onziga, Susan, and Wamboza. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Advanced Diploma in Health Services Management of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Achiru, Achiruchani, Adiru, Ajiyo, Alule, Arima, Asianzu, Atidura, Awakinomungu, che, Chengimoko, Chemayek, Brambo, Eminia, Kudumbura, Kumakech, Maturu, Mayani, Nyakuru, Ochokuru, Ogeniwos, Okero, and Yada. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidate who successfully completed his studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in Library and Information Science of the Islamic University in Uganda. He is Isogolo Moses. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in the Computer Science and Information Technology of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Akik, Ali, Kourakia, Kwagala, Lukuya, Mutes, Obirakol, Omar, Serinjogi, Wangoro, Wekoe, and Wachage Ashim. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in Records Management of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Amukambwe, Bako, Eyoru, Gulam, Kinume, Chiza, Kwiri, Munyole, Musa, Nakawiye, Nachintu, Ninsima, Nusula, Uwase, and Wakoye Godfrey. May the graduates of the Diploma in Midwifery Extension, Diploma in General Nursing, Diploma in General Nursing Extension, please stand up and raise up your right hand to swear the professional oath. Please stand up, raise up your right hand to swear the professional oath. Please repeat after me. I solemnly pledge myself before God and the presence of this assembly to pass 
my life in purity and to practice my profession faithfully. I'll abstain from what, whatever is deleterious and mischievous and will not take or knowingly administer any harmful drug. I'll do all in my power to elevate the standard of my nursing profession and will hold in confidence all personal matters committed to my keeping and all family affairs coming to my knowledge in the practice of my calling. With royalty, will I endeavor to aid the physician in his work and devote myself to the welfare of those committed to my care. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed her studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in Midwifery Extension of the Islamic University in Uganda. She is? Nekesa Caroline. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who have su successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in General Nursing of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are? Namkwaya Sharifa, Nandu Dukamia, Nataba Christine Miro, Waminga Jamio. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Diploma in General Nursing Extension of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are? Ajaro Agnes, Akwime Rab, Shemwaria Simon Patel, Lisidi Benjamin, Kapsegei Isaac, Kaitisa Mary, Chesa Violet, Kwa Gabeti, Cheru Miriam, Chocho Rosemary, Nachilanda Khadija, Namuto C. Joyce, Ojange Musa, Tegu Siraji, and Mwanyeze Bridget Tegu. Bismillah. By virtue of the powers entrusted to me, I congratulate all of you whose names have been read for the undergraduate diploma awards of the Islamic University in Uganda in your respective programs as presented by the deans. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir. I have the honor to present to you the candidate who successfully completed his studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of the Bachelor of Arts in Social Sciences of the Islamic University in Uganda. He is Abdullahi Abdi Noor. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir. I have the honor to present to you a candidate who successfully completed his studies in the year 2019-2020 academic year for the award of the Bachelor of Arts in Economics of the Islamic University in Uganda. He is Sevoliva Mahad. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir. I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed her studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of the Bachelor of Science in Mass Communication of the Islamic University in Uganda. She is Jamia Wacha Mohammed. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir. I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of the Bachelor of Science, Social Work and Social Administration of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Adiru Zuraika, Babu Mba Ibrahim, Dariru Segra Abdi, Draguma Ahmed, Draguru Hatima, Fatuma Kakwezire, Hainja Aisha, Hayati Sadiru Abubak, Kakoza Hassan, Kakoza Hamidu, Chitata Agnes, Kwagahawa, Lulu Jam Jamao, Wakulia Robert, Munira Abubakari, Nabukwa Sirecho Kadori, Nabulia Jaura Hassan, Nabutiha Julius, Nabutanda Zulaika, Nagawa Shakira, Naka Bugo Olivia, Naka Tude Rowena Rose, Naka Ziva Saida, Naruga Sawia, Namale Sara, Namugosa Morin, Nanyonjo Zahara, Nasozi Mastura, Nsimbe Sulaiman, 
Olema Zubairi, Risala Naiti, Riziki Mwini Ali, Salima Abbas, Semanda Musa Sekana, Sekandi Akram, Wavisade Safina, Zaitun Muhammad, and Zaitun Jamar. Uh, Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of the Bachelor of Development Studies of the, of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Abdul Majid Nasur, Alamanga Toha Mohammed, Alima Knight Achira, Alon Abdibu, Anditi Farouk, Aisha Omar Hasi, Atai Mary, Fahia Muhammad Muhammad, Hamida Yasin Musa, Kampeza Linda, Kemigisa Bright, Kulava Komastura, Mbachivi Tahia, Mutiwa Ayub, Nantambi Zahara, Nashar Jacqueline, Sada Fadila Ibrahim, Samia Umar, Semwanga Yahaya, Sumaya Ahmed Abdi, and Taban Rashid. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Education external of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Birunji Babra Matha, Buyi Dik, Gizamba Musa, and Mugamba Isima. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Science Education of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Higwire Farouk, Mugamba Muhammadi, Mulindwa Muhammad Kizito, Nabundu Wilson Emma, Nambuira Musa, Orite Vicent, Waguvi Isaac, and Wasangai Jabin. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Battle of Arts Education of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Alija Janat, Bamweyana Yusuf, Barasa Kevin, Chelangati Lucy, Damone Benjamin, Emuge Alfred, Faida Ahmed, Fatia Muhammad, Fatuma Ali, Galiwango Fahad, Gidale Fahad, Igaswale, Kabagwere Amina, Katusime Fauza, Rubanga Aslam, Maleki Wanuka Muhammad, Masibo Shakira, Masisa Wilson, Masuba Sad, Mayanja Atik, Atika, Mirembe Shira, Mugide Shaliwa, Mulogo Juma, Musaki Lucia, Mwagale Zamzam, Nabatanzi Zaharat, Nabende Isima, Nabude Loy, Nabukalu Jowan, Nabukonde Rehema, Nabionga Walda, Naigino na Hamida, Najuma Hawa, Nakachwa Salima, Nakagolo Sharita, Nakakembo Saida, Nakamate Shakira, Nakatude Hanifa, Nakintu Sara Kavuma, Nalugo Nusurat, Nalusiva Swabura, Namaganda Maimuna Kawesi, Namanda Zainab, Namatome Beatrice, Nambafu Mariam Shiba, Namiro Haula, Namgalu Huda, Namulema Zulaika, Nandera Linda, Nankasi Fatima, Nanyunja Hafuswa, Nasuna Lydia, Naiga Joeria, Nazigoma Sharifa, Nemwa Rahamat, Mkutu Dalaus, Namtevi Sara, Sama Nyazaina, Sumaya Hussein, Namugosa, Wafula Alex, Wayasa Abdubasi, and Zinga Amina Hamis. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor 
to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Arts, Islamic Studies, and Arabic Language of the Islamic University of Uganda. They are Nditiamawa Abdurazak, Isa Abdul Qadir Isaac, Abdul Qadir Isaac, and Chibuka Azhar Ahmad. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman Sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Arts Sharia of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Abdul Aziz Ramadan Baguma, Asad Senyange, Jailan Hashim Abdullah, Kiza Abu Bakar Muhammad, Lugaizi Shafi, Maganda Nurain Muzamiru, Namugosa Sara, and Were Abdul Karim. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Laws at the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Abdallah Saida Salim, Achan Doli, Achen Mary, Hadok Jen, Adong Joan, Akel Fazira, Akena George Robert, Akol Benjamin, Akosimira Shakira, Alep Christopher, Aloikin Evelyn, Ahom Rachel, Angupal Joyce, Anyanzo Emmanuel, Asimwe Arnold, Atmango Mary Teresa, Awori Sandra, Auf Ratib, Haibaziwe Innocent, Aisiga Raymond, Babalanda Edmond, Babire Madina, Babire Sobra, Bagenda Remy, Bai Dawa Janat, Bawidri Stephen, Bai Kadri, Birony Saida, Birony Sarah, Bunus Fahad, Buinza Joel, Boy Abdul Hakim, Jamazima Joshua, Jamukama Elasmus, Chadiha Ndeke, Charangat Aisha Sabila, Dabo Aminat Daisy, Otoma Noto, Guyawade Mzafal, Asahia Shafik, Hashim Ari, Igul Abdallah, Ngabire Sharihan, Vaibi Charles, Jagwe Solomon, Jumba Joseph, Junju Shamila, Juko Yahya, Kabubi Payas, Kagolola Juma, Kagwa Najib, Kalikwira Godfrey, Kamara Jaffi Samuel, Kangao Rogers, Karashani Wycliffe, Karekezi Junior, Kasai Swabra, Kasemire Catherine, Katamba Ramadan, Katende Elfaz, Kato Shafik, Katongol Abdul, Katumba Kasim, Katshabe Michelle, Kawaga Zawena, Kawaya Ismail, Kawaya Peter, Kayanja Edward, Kayongo Yakub, Kivenge Philip, Kivuka Elton Paul, Kijambu Douglas, Kimera John, Kimuli Musa, Kintu Alamanzan, Kisarita Baker, Kisembo Murungi, Kisitu John, Kiwanuka Aaron, Kiwanuka Joshua, Kizire Nakendo Ibrahim, Kizito Adil, Kivokwe Kenneth, Kuzera Rashid, Kiabagu Lemon, Chozira Shamim, Kibwama Moses, Lake Zahara, Lulika Sharif Muhammad, Lulinda Resti, Mabombe Ramazan, Mafabi Nasurwe Samoyo, Mafabi Timothy Peter, Magom Derek, Mahade Siraj Kiremba, Mariat Dauda Naburia, Masagaz Abu, Matov Haruna, Matiama Julius, Mayaku Dens, Mayango Daud Sharif, Mazi Amira Asumin, Balire Muhammad, Panji David, Pengere Mahad Kaziba, Ponga Abed, Mudanga Bob, Muganga Halawi, Mugera Hakim, Mugisha Shafik, Muhammad Wahib, Muhewa Deborah, Mukiri Aran Bamuaira, Mukula Muhammad, Mukwalu Paul, Muledu James, Mulinda Uzama, Mungurieki Zulaika, Murungi Fanila, Musigire Charles, Musoke Mariat Namyaro, Mutawe Nina, Mwanguzi Daniel Victor, Mwangala Erika Gengo, Nabire Lilian Lydia, Nabitalo Jamila, Nabongo Agri, Nabukal Irene Viola, Nabukenya Joan, Nafula Martha Karunji, Nagai Hadija, Nagodi Shifa, Najuma Maimuna, Nakawuye Nasha Kaule, Nakade Subura Zula, 
na Kalema Maureen, na Kasenge Margaret, na Kato Shakira, na Kaya Jessica, na Kayenza Maureen, na Kaima Rita Nora, na Chijoba Shamila, na Chiveru Hadija, na Lela Njalila Kasim, na Ulega Dori Mawelin, na Lugwa Angela, na Luja Shamila, na Luka Gohawa, na Mans Christine, na Luoza Shakila, na Liomo Debra, na Maganda Hanifa, na Maweja Sinaina, na Mayanja Jacqueline, na Mbari Rahajara, na Mbifiru Daus, na Mirembe Rukia, na Mtala Rehema, na Mudusmaya, na Mdosi Safula, na Mgra Fazila, na Msoke Zainab, na Mtevi Shakila, na Mtos Fuvaida, na Mwanga Rosemail, na Mwaya Recho, na Mwenyongo Walda, na Ndala Isabes Zemei, na Ntambi Jalia, na Ntambi Umaira, na Ntege Mastula, na Ura Bridget, na Gile Mari, na Gile Pauline, Ngobi Juma, na Nsima Smaya, na Wagawa Fiska, Subuga Aksam, Tambi Michael Blair, Tuma Shabili La Albeka, na Wamanya Brian, na Mhunge Ann Mary, na Nomugisha Joan, Obo Philip Mwomba, Odongo Shadrach Angulu, Ofumbi Oscar Godfrey, Ogwang Ronald Okwaka, Oko Steven, Olauna Emmanuel Olum, Olum Samson, Port Alex, Omara Tony, Nicol Max, Omuga Sho Catherine, Orungroth Nafi Ayiko, Rehema Nayenda, Ruyale Kere Christopher, Rupin James Kitara, Sekubwa Robert Ranga, Selunkuma Adam, Sitinor Abdallah, Sebal Sharifa, Seka Vila Rafat, Samakula Brian, Samatimba Isa, Sempija Ashraf, Samwanga Richard, Sarada Salim, Sozi Sulaiman, Sozi Zakaria, Tukamshaba Prize, Tumusime Simon, Tumusime Zulfa, Tumesige Stuart Godwin, Tumwine Wills, Wawire Anthon Silva, Waigonda Robert Mary Enos, Wanyana Diana, Wayenza Sharon Mary, Wanzira Philip Elfaz, Waswa Yusuf, Wasemwa Esther, Wekoyera Derek Enoch, Wazemba Dens, Zakes Raj, Zawede Esther Muyia, Zawede Maureen, Zawede Rashida, and Zwa Hassan. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their study. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Secretarial and Administrative Studies of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Masika Salima, Namanke Mahajara, Nabulime Sharifa, Nakimuli Fahima, Nakato Farida, Nakumiza Sandra, Naki Denaswi Hasuvi, Nakirio Ajamida, Namutebi Rahma, Nantai Aisha, and Soraya Sabira. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Human Resources Management of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Amina Dawe Hassan, Cherangat Emily, Eduve Lincoln, Faiza Hussein Gedi, Fatuma Omar, Katusave Jansinta, Nawonso Zainab, Nalukomwa Fazira, Namaganda Hadija, Nambazira Fatuma, Namuyanja Rashida, Namuaya Arizik, Nantongo Shamira, Nasoz Hajara, and Wandwasi John. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Procurement and Logistics Management of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Amin Ismail, Aomu Samulonga, 
Deru Zubair, Hanada Yanguya, Lebu Akim, Mahadi Muhazam, Musema Martin, Masa Iman, Nambali Rahadija, Nkoto Sadat, Otua David, Tirio Sam, Tabana Bibu Nasur, Ukasha Ahmed Umar, and Wires Ismail. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Public Administration of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Bako Raima, Baraka Sabani Ataso, Chandiru Lidia, Kenya David Nafar, Kisame James, Logo Sejanat, Maria Manani Komure, Mugoya Richard, Naweteme Asia, Nakibirango Maimuna, Nasibu Moses, Natu Sara, Naiga Shadia, Ochaya Charity, and Ochuru Rasur. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Science in Health Services Management of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Amase Caroline, Anita Joyce, Bahati Loja, Durasiri Isaac, Ikaju Payas, Imwangani Alois, Okadapao, Kayele Emmanuel Wasigiria, Runyolo Rosemary Musafu, Madiki Edward Atiku, Madunda Emmanuel, Mafavi Twaha, Magino George, Mudeda Derek, Mikwara Jonathan Wangwe, Nankinga Aida, Okodi Patrick, Alionzo Harris, Osaru Zena Jane, Oyaku Matthew, We Julie Etemoti David, and Wenwa Valentine. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Business Studies of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Naima Wamala, Abdi Aziz Hassan Adan, Abdu Wahab Habib, Alice Serifa, Amanya Sheba, Amuviko Stera, and Rekulu Kubra, Angoliga, Zubai, Aliya Lukia, Atik Simera Bubaka, Atuhaire Hairat Kalio, Ayoni Martin, Bakali Umaru Bungale, Bako Amina, Bakole Alex, Balira Ahmed, Bwambale Joffre, Drambere Afan, Kavasomi Ket Kaspa, Kachamba Asia Ansar, Kanton Obeti Joyce, Karunga Saidat, Kemigisa Rabiat, Kemirembe Viva Nitendo, Kitaka Hanifa, Kitembwa Musa, Konyia Gloria, Mayani Omaru Sheikh Ahmed, Masaba Ibrahimu Amaede, Bavali Sharifa, Miraga Hassan, Mugabe Ismail, Muganda Abed, Musuvika Najat, Mutonyi Sharifa, Nabalunzi Sharua, Nabira Muhammad Said, Nabiria Kigeni Mariam, Navidia Zaija, Navidia Zauja, Naguja Joeria, Nakakawa Sara, Nakake Sumaya, Nakayemba Zauja, Narukwago Asha, Naruoza Sumaya, Nambali Rahafsa, Namigade Shamira, Namisi Richard, Namlinda Rehema, Nangobi Afwa, Nangobi Shamira, Nasas Hanan, Nasas Shamira, Nasubuga Amina, Nasubuga Shifwa, na Sukusa Deisi, na Anteza Mariam, na Sasira Zahara, na Wagu Mashira, Ramadhani Bokasa Longa, Saliha Ali, Shakira Ajone Aluma, Stabo Akidir, Wekomba Payas, Zainabu Ahmed, and Zainabu Ali. Graduates from science. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year 
for the award of Bachelor of Library and Information Science of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Fatuma Masudu Ame, Obomu Isa, and Saleh Shaban. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Science in Computer Science of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Abdul Aziz Abdul Hai Farah, Gamma Ibrahim, and Opoloto Alex. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Records Management for the Bachelor of Food Science, this award was misreaded, Food Science and Nutrition of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Dugo Aliyo Abdulhai, Dumba Shakira, Hamid Muhammad Osman, Ibrahim Abushir Said Samatri, Namono Ibula, Ruweda Hussein Jama Daishe, Salihu Adiza, Zaitun Sumaise Mbango. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the Bachelor of Science in Environmental Science of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Amuge Richard Michael, Kalanje Abdurrahman, Masaba Ayub, Masiga Justin, Mbo Mongoloi, Mukai Sara, Neumbo Majuma Mauna, Obo John Kuzostom, Samira Wasame Ali, and Wanyeze Rita. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-20 academic year for the award of Battle of Statistics of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Abdukadir Muhammad Musa Osman, Abdulhai Muhammad Abud, Faizo Wali Ahmed, Kajuri Ismail, Muhammad Ali Muhammad, Nabasir Rufaida, Nzombu Joyce, Ogera Ukash, Saidi Hamdan, Sengola Abdul Nasir, and Tukei Aron. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Information Technology of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Aidid Abushir, sorry, Aidid Bashir, Aliao Dagalas, Asingwira Hanifa, Bagala Musa, ba Bataliwo Imran, Birungi Sekina, Bugingo Abdara Zake, Kalaki Madina Zikusoka, Kalule Aisha, Kambale Sharifa, Kamada Ismail Ali, Kasumba Falahamula Waswa, Katusabe Ian, Kaye Umar, Kibirige Abraham, Kisingo Muslim Abdalatif, Kizito Mansur, Kiza Jacqueline Natewa, Lubega Faham, Magombe Mike, Maguma, Maguma Zai, Matov Amir, Matov Isaac, Mugerwa Dorek, Mugigai Roshman, Mugisha Gideon, Mukiri Badru, Mukosa Saddam, Mim Abdallah, Na, Nabi Shamim, Na Habwe Ambrose, Na Kamome Salia, Na Kaziva Hadija, Na Chiganda Jarida, Na Chintu Hasina Bikula, Ki, Na Chito Zulufa, Na, na Kivumbi Aisha, Na Lubwama Aisha Swale, Na Lule Sharifa, Na Lumans Mariam, Na Maweja Sharifa, Na Mbori Rabiati Shifura, Na Muyanja Zam, Na Nguindo Fatuma, Na Samba Jamila Iga, Na Nsukusa Sumaya, Na Sozi Sumaya, Na Ndaula Nua, Nsobia Ntege Nasa, Ochen Andrew Benjamin, Ogongolo Aguri, Sagala Shari Asherifu, Sekanabo, Zu, Zuraika, Sempala Abdul Karim Nasa, Senyonja Tusubira Edwin, Sega Alex, Sekamate Hanifu, Semu Genzi Abu Bakar, Senoga Muzamir, Serubula Sulaiman, Sonko Hanifa, Wataka Shiraf, and Wekesa Fahad. May the graduates of Bachelor of Medicine and Bachelor of Surgery please stand up. 
please raise up your right hand to swear the physician's oath. Please repeat after me. As a member of the medical profession, I solemnly pledge to dedicate my life to the service of humanity. The health and well-being of my patient will be my first consideration. I respect the autonomy and dignity of my patient. I'll maintain the utmost respect for human life. I'll not permit considerations of age, disease or disability, creed, ethnic origin, gender, nationality, political affiliation, race, sexual orientation, social standing, or any other factor to intervene between my duty and my patient. I respect the secrets that are confided in me even after the patient has died. I'll practice my profession with conscience and dignity and in accordance with a good medical practice. I'll foster the honor and noble traditions of the medical profession. I'll give to my teachers, colleagues, and students the respect and gratitude that is their due. I'll share my medical knowledge for the benefit of the patient and the advancement of health care. I'll attend to my own health, well-being, and abilities in order to provide care of the highest standard. I'll not use my medical knowledge to violate human rights and civil liberties even under threat. I make these promises solemnly, freely, and upon my honor. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Bachelor of Medicine and Bachelor of Surgery of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Abdullah Ahmad, Ahimbisiwe Al-Fail, Aid Isaac Joseph, Aisha Sara Tasnim, Atala Etoko Christine, Atwebembele Raymond, Ayan Muhammad Ali, Ayebare Angela Arije, Babirie Shamim, Bashil Hikmat, Bugembe Faizo, Ditai James, Eju Sith, Emaichu Kenneth, Fatuma Pistu Muhammad, Gwiwa Mariam Ibrahim, Hanan Namtevi Sulaiman, Hapsat Adam Usman, Kabuye Hamza, Katerega Fredlik, Katom Martin, Khalid Nasiru Sabiyu, Chizito Benjamin Birunji, Chiza Amina Muhammad, Kusolo Collins, Luchamz Walter Karim, Maria Murwasa Naruge Afra, Mirembe Claire, Muwendo Huda, Mwanje Benjamin, Naba Tanzi Debra, Naba Wanda Salwa, Nabisi Rame Kamori, Nabukera Shalwa Kabogo, Nafuna Fatuma, Nagai Aisha Kasure, Najingo Sofia Chisure, Nakamanya Sharifa, Nakanwaji Fatuma Ali, Narubega Goreti, Namagembe Kanima, Nambiru Sofia, Namgere Husin Mbarak, na, Namkose Najwa, Namfka Mariam, Nante Zaunia, Niyagaba Rona, Nsubga Hamis, Nyacho Patience Magara, Ochen Innocent, Ochen Hilary Kenneth, Odokonyero Abdallah Fadir, Otire Jacob, Sadika Tijan Mato, Sema Anda Juma, Semuja Gilbert, and Suhaib Farahat Abdul Samia. Bismillah. By virtue of the powers entrusted to me, I confer upon you, whose names have been read, for the undergraduate degree awards of the Islamic University in Uganda in your respective programs as presented by the deans. Congratulations. And I wish to congratulate the Vice Director of Finance and Administration, Professor Dr. Ampata, whose daughter is graduating in medicine today. Okay. Congratulations, our daughter. And I want to recognize the presence in our midst of uh, Mr. Mzamir Mukwata Ampola, who is representing the Minister of Education and Sports. Yes, sir.
He's also an alumnus of IUIU. Yeah. I also want to recognize the Secretary General of the Uganda Muslim Supreme Council, Lahaji Mugaru, uh, who is also a member of the council. You are welcome. And His Excellency, by the way, my boss, the good president, come here and let the others see you. You, the, 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 the students who are graduating, this is my boss, and therefore your boss. His Excellency, Yusuf Uerunga, the good president. Thank you. Proceed. Miss Mila, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidate who successfully completed his studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of postgraduate diploma in management and teaching at higher education of the Islamic University in Uganda. He is Nabiro Yusuf. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of postgraduate diploma in human resource management of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Aguta Gabriel, Amina Ahmed, Agudubo Emmanuel, Atibu Muzamil, Bako Florence, Dramadire Hirali, Akonabongo Hassan Changa. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of postgraduate diploma in public administration of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Adaku Alex, Ajoga Mudasi Rukavaka, Ali Gabonda Ombani, Ali Yunus, Dramani Albert Newton, Ezati Timoth Maruma, Odaga Wilfred Onega, Opikabo James, and Oroma Mili. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of postgraduate diploma in project planning and management of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Akuru Joan, Amuviko Faima, Andati Firiam Emmanuel, Deri Amsdalil, Edaku David, Etoma Charis, Fadir Barhan Salim, Bakole Safi, Maliko Mary, Odongo Alex, and Yumati Alfred. Bismillah. By virtue of the powers entrusted to me, I congratulate all of you whose names have been read for the postgraduate diploma awards of the Islamic University in Uganda in your respective programs as presented by the respective deans. Congratulations. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir. I have the honor to present to you the candidates who, who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of the Master of Arts in Swahili of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Katshavi Jacqueline, Mungonya Bruhan Saidi, Watira Feo. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Master of Education of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Masingano Mohammed and Mohammed Mohamud Abdullahi. Bismillah. 
Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidate who successfully completed his studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Master of Arts in Arabic Language of the Islamic University in Uganda. He is Mustafa Yerima Tahir. Bismillah, Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Master of Islamic Banking and Finance of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Abdurrahim Abdullahi Noor and Yuki Ismail Abubakar. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Master of Business Administration of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Chesanga Sira Hasifa, Mulumba Sala, Saidi Olawi, Saidi Omar. Bismillah. Mr. Chairman, sir, I have the honor to present to you the candidates who successfully completed their studies in the 2019-2020 academic year for the award of Master of Public Administration of the Islamic University in Uganda. They are Kakoza Henry, Naigembe Catherine, and Nantume Jennifer. Bismillah, by virtue of the powers entrusted to me, I confer upon you, whose names have been read, for the master's degrees of the Islamic University in Uganda, in your respective programs as presented by the deans. You may note that in the booklet you have other students who graduated in executive board. That's another formal route for graduation. And those students were already awarded the various awards as indicated in the graduation booklet. And I think this brings us to the end of the Uh, we want to recognize the district council of Jishu, Sheikh Hamad Issa Masaba, uh, who has a daughter who is graduating with a degree in medicine. Now, Funa Uma, our district council in Mbale, congratulations, and congratulations to our daughter, Fatima. And Dr. Rubanga, our staff. Oh, Dr. Rubanga, where are you? Somewhere. You know? Uh, he's in the secretariat. Uh, our, our child is also graduating in medicine. Yeah. Oh, this is the days of Sheikhs and uh, this guy. His Eminence, the Mufti of Uganda, as a daughter who is graduating in law today. Yeah. Uh, so that is the indicator of the importance of IUIU to the Ummah and to Uganda in general and Africa in general. That's why at an occasion like this, it was very emotional for me, having put in 33 years of my life and seeing us succeeding the way we are and uh, looking forward to my next assignment at the OIC General Secretariat as Assistant Secretary General in charge of Economic Affairs, and leaving behind a team that I trust should be able to take forward the university uh, in a proper way. And uh, I must request that we all continue to pray for IU, IU to continue excelling and conquering greater heights. And thank everybody who has contributed to this growth and stability of this institution. May Allah continue to protect this university. Amen. Closing door? 
dissolution. The, chair, the dwarf first and then the chairman uh, they dissolve or Do I first? A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem Bismillahir rahmanir rahim Wa la tahnu wa la tahzanu وأنتم الأعلون إن كنتم مؤمنين إن يمسسكم قرح فقد مس القوم قرح مثله وتلك الأيام نداولها بين الناس وَيَعْلَمَ اللَّهُ الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا وَيَتَّقِذَ مِنْكُمْ شُهَدَاءُ وَاللَّهُ لَا يُحِبُّ الظَّالِمِينَ وَيُمَحِّصَ اللَّهُ الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا وَيَمْحَقَ الْكَافِرِينَ أَمْ حَسِبْتُمْ أَنْ تَدْخُلُوا الْجَنَّةَ وَلَمَّا يَعْلَمِ اللَّهُ وَلَمَّا يَعْلَمِ اللَّهُ الَّذِينَ جَاهَدُوا مِنْكُمْ وَيَعْلَمُ الصَّابِرِينَ وَلَقَدْ كُنْتُمْ تَمَنَّوْنَ الْمَوْتَ مِنْ قَبْلُ أن تلقاه فقد رأيتموه وأنتم تنظرون وما محمد إلا رسول قد قلت من قبله الرسل أفإن مات أو قتلا قلبتم على أعقابكم وَمَنْ يَنْقَلِبْ عَلَىٰ عَكِبَيْهِ فَلَنْ يَذُورَ اللَّهَ شَيْئًا وَسَيَجْزِ اللَّهُ الشَّاكِرِينَ صدق الله العظيم شكرا شكرا Chairman, to do the last part I just want to recognize the two students who have recited the opening dua and the closing dua. The opening dua was cited by Kabuye Hamza, who is a medical student, a degree in medicine. The closing dua has just been recited by Kiza Violet Mariam, who is a diploma in nursing. The one thing to note about Mariam is that she's a revert to Islam, but she has also memorized the entire Quran. Congratulations to her. May I now take the honor and privilege to invite Professor Dr. Talal Al Maliki, Chairman of the University Council, to dissolve this congregation. Professor. Professor, 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 Professor. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. By virtue of the powers entrusted to me, I declare this 28th congregation of the Islamic University in Uganda dissolved. National anthems and uh, we end. <laughs>
Thank you very much. Uh, dear students, please remain seated. Your academic documents, you are going to pick them from here just after our guests have uh, gone. Please remain seated. Go home with your academic documents. Uh, once again, uh, we take this opportunity to thank everybody for joining us to the 28th graduation of the Islamic University in Uganda. Remember, admissions are still going on. Uh, you can still pick application for the various courses that are offered at the Islamic University in Uganda. Also, you are reminded that uh, Islamic University in Uganda is going to run some new courses, which includes the Master of Science in Political Science, that will start this coming academic year. Uh, we also have Diploma in Social Work and Community Development, which will run this academic year. Diploma in International Relations and Diplomacy. Uh, we have a Bachelor of Science in Political Science. We have PhD in International Affairs and Humanitarian Diplomacy. All these are new programs that are going to be mounted very soon. So those of you out there, or family, friends, uh, colleagues, Remind them that these things are happening at IU. IU, welcome. Applications are going on. Please come and pick. Like Alia said, mature age entry exams will be running around uh, 2nd of uh, January. So those interested, please, uh, you go to IU, IU offices in Arua, in Mbale, and all those places, pick the application. The qualification is you should do, be able to speak, read, and write English. You must be 22 years of age and above to qualify for those, and you pay for that application fee. So that, um, Yes, uh, we also have it at Females Campus. Please do come and pick those application forms. Uh, it's an opportunity for you to uh, do a degree course in humanities if you did not have the opportunity to finish senior five, six, and so on and so forth. Here is the opportunity for you. Uh, members, COVID-19 is real. Let us continue with uh, putting on our masks and maintain physical distance. I, I don't want to use the word social distance. I prefer physical distance. Let us maintain physical distance, but keep the social uh, relations going on. This disease is real. Like said earlier, it has uh, snatched uh, a big number of well-known members of our community uh, whose names were read for us here. So let us take care of ourselves and continue being careful in our mosques and in all those other places where we normally uh, congregate as Muslims. So thank you for coming. And our next graduation, like announced earlier, is coming around 27th of March. Uh, you are invited in advance. Uh, so I uh, wish you all the best. 
and safe journeys back home. Uh, our continuing students are beginning their exams, uh, I think around, uh, around Monday, Monday next week, exams will be uh, for the continuing students, and then they will resume their studies at the end of the um, month, January. That's around 30th of January is when the new academic year is beginning. Thank you for coming. Thank you for joining IUIU to this uh, occasion. Um, medical and nursing students, your academic documents, ensure you get them. Congratulations and congratulations for making it to this day. Uh, we thank you for being there and we thank you for the patience. We thank you for the discipline. And please, when we go out there, please continue with the physical distance and put on your masks. Put on your masks. The excitements are there, but let us continue to be careful. Thank you.